Hi, welcome to Lessons with John. Uh, today we're going to try Run to Me on the ook. Alright, I realize there's no ukulele in the song, for those of you in the comment section. <laughs> Let me know that. Alright, uh, I skipped the intro. Boring, it's just an A arpeggio, uh, A chord that's arpeggiated. So, uh, right into the verse. Here's the verse. A to a G. F sharp minor to a D chord, B minor to an E chord. And that's it. So that's your verse. A chord, fourth string, second fret, third string, first fret. My strum today is going to be down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up. Okay, so down, 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 up, up, down, 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 up. That's going to be the strum on every single chord, except there's two chords that share a measure in the chorus when we get to that, and I'll show you what to do there, okay? But that's the only change in the whole song. So you got your A chord we talked about. We're going to go to a G chord, third string, first string, second fret, second string, third fret, same strum. Then an F sharp minor, which is the fourth string, second fret, second string, second fret, third string, first fret, okay? And then I want to go to a D chord, so I'm going to go fourth string, third string, second string, second fret, okay? Then a B minor, I'm going to bar the second fret, and then the fourth string, fourth fret, okay? My next chord is E, uh, first string, second fret, fourth, third, and second string at the fourth fret. Okay, and those of you that know me, that is like, that's, I can't fit my fingers in there for that chord, so that's a tough one, for me anyway. Alright, so let's go over that verse again. So uh, this is the part, if you've ever got rain in your heart, someone has hurt you and torn you apart. Horrible. Alright, so A, to a G, F sharp minor, and torn you apart is a D. Minor to an E, and then what you do is you repeat because the, then we have another verse, so you just repeat all that again. Uh, that's uh, the me loving you girl and you loving me part. Uh, all right, so let's jump to the chorus now. The chorus is uh, run to me whenever you're lonely, so that's going to be an A chord to a C sharp minor to a D. sharp 7 to a B minor 7 flat 5 and then E6 you just hit it once oh so I did lie so <laughs> the strum pattern is a little different there uh, so I lied right to you sorry get over it all right the chorus is an A chord which we've already gone over then you need a C sharp minor uh, bar the fourth fret and the fourth string sixth fret okay that's my C sharp minor we talked about the D chord is next. We're going to make it a D minor now. Uh, fourth string, third string, second fret, second string, first fret. That's my D minor. And then this next measure is that A and G that uh, share a measure. So uh, we already talked about the A and G, but let's talk about the strum pattern while we're on that spot. So the first four moves of your long strum pattern is what you do on each one of these chords. So A is down, 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 up, then same thing on the G. Okay, so it's like A to a G, and that's it. Next chord you're going to need is F sharp 7. Uh, that's the uh, second string, second fret, fourth string, third fret, third string, fourth fret and the pinky is the first string fourth fret. That's an F sharp seven. Back to the long strum. Now uh, I'm gonna go to a B minor seven flat five for my next chord. Now it might seem difficult but I'm just gonna pull this uh, everybody's gonna go back this way. So my first f finger is gonna go to the second string first fret and then all the rest of the fingers are on the right strings, 
they just all go back to the second fret. Okay? So in the end, it's second string, first fret, fourth and third string, second fret, and first string, second fret. But it's really not that hard because you're coming from this chord, this F sharp seven, and you'll watch. I just drag everybody back, okay? And that's a B minor seven flat five. And then I'm gonna hit an E6 and just let it ring and uh, then go back into another verse. Now later on in the song, when we repeat the chorus at the end of the song, you, um, you might wanna play right through that, okay? And then and just keep repeating, but I'll show you that. We'll get to that. All right. So uh, if you don't like the E6, by the way, it is. It sounds sounds like what's going on in the song to me. You could just hit an E chord if you don't. If the ears aren't ready for you know that that chord, but I think that's what they're doing in the song. So the piano. Uh, all right. So let's go over that chorus one more time. A. C sharp minor, D, D minor whenever you're lonely, A to G to an F sharp 7, and a B minor 7 flat 5 to an E6, and then you're back to back to another verse. Okay? So the uh, the form of the song, let's talk about that. There's an intro, it's very it's just an A arpeggio they're playing um, while the piano plays a few notes on top. Uh, if you really want it, I will do it. I did it on the guitar, but I didn't bother with the ook. Um, it's just, uh, I would skip it if I was playing the song, that's all. Uh, then you got your verse, followed by another verse, then the chorus, then the verse again, followed by another verse, and then the chorus, 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 and they fade out. Okay? So, again, the verse is A to a G to an F sharp minor to a D, B minor to an E, then you repeat, A is another verse, G, F sharp minor, me loving you girl and you loving me is a D. Was he unwise with a B minor chord to an E chord? And then your to A is run to me. When a C sharp minor is lonely. D chord to a D minor. A to G to an F sharp seven. B minor seven flat five. You hit the E six one time and you're back to a verse. sharp minor to a D, B minor to an E, then you do another verse, A to a G, got nothing to lose, F sharp minor, nothing to pay for, and a D chord, nothing to choose, B minor to an E, and then A, C sharp minor, this is a run to me part. D to a D minor. A to a G to an F sharp seven to a B minor seven flat five. This time I'm gonna play through the E6 because we're gonna keep repeating the, uh, the chorus. A to a C sharp minor, run to him. And then D. Seven, B minor seven flat five, E six. You can stop it if you wanted to. All right, so let's wrap it up. C sharp minor, D, D minor, A to G to an F sharp seven, B minor seven flat five. I'm gonna hit it once. E six. They fade out. And then you would end on an A chord if you don't have the ability to fade out like most of us. Any questions, comments down below? Um, I think I went over all the chords. I hope I did. 
All right, uh, please subscribe and thanks for watching.